Abriha Gabramariam was forced to flee from her hometown Maikadra in western Tigray to Magala due to the war in Tigray. Abriha says the Eritrean forces in Amhara Fano killed her father and tortured her husband. She also asks for justice to be served. <laughs> The perpetrators who cleanse the innocent civilians must be held accountable. I first fled to Shira from Maikadra when the war broke out. Then I was forced to flee from Shira to Ma'ala due to the second round of Eritrean troops invasion. We came across many difficulties to reach here. My father and my husband didn't flee when the war broke out first. They killed my father. They tied and hit my husband, and his leg got paralyzed as a result. He can't walk. I had to carry him myself when we fled for the second time. We managed to reach here, passing through non-stop drone attacks and wild animals. We reunited with our children after a long time. The displaced woman also adds her suffering continues as she is starving along with her family because she says the aid they get in the IDP's camp is insufficient to meet their daily need. Even after we reached here, we're still suffering. We do not have bed, food, or even money to buy our basics. My children ask me to buy them basic needs, however I have nothing at hand to provide them with what they need. They occasionally get biscuits in the morning to fill their bellies. Abriha hopes to return home and take care of her family once again. <laughs> We need the peace deal to be implemented fully and return to our homes immediately. We're in a dire condition, especially the children are suffering from hunger. If we get back to our homes, we'll work hard and take care of our children. We need to live a good life.